We begin with breaking news this afternoon. Julia Tomlin just made an appearance in juvenile court. Now this is for new charges in her son's death. And now she's accused of murdering two year old Noah Tomlin. And this arraignment this morning comes just days after the Hampton Commonwealth's attorney announced that Noah died from blunt force trauma and battered child syndrome. Julia Tomlin originally reported Noah missing in June, but his body was found nine days later. 13 News Now's Nico Clemens was in the courtroom this morning. Nico. Dan, we didn't see much emotion from Julia Tomlin today when the judge read her new charges of murder and disposal of a dead body. She kept her head down, answered a couple of questions about her job and income status, but that's really about it. But as you all mentioned, as we all know by now, Tomlin is accused of murdering and killing her two-year-old son, Noah Tomlin. We learned last week from the Commonwealth Attorney's Office, Hampton, Wealth's Com Hampton Commonwealth Attorney Anton Bell, that the toddler died from blunt force trauma and battered child syndrome. Hampton Commonwealth's attorney Anton Bell told us the toddler's injuries were not only severe, but horrific, describing Noah's injuries as if a child had fallen several stories from a building. We heard from Noah Tomlin's biological father last week. He told 13 News Now he's beyond angry. He would have taken full custody away from Julia Tomlin because of her drug use. And if he knew if he knew Noah was his son, he would have fought for him. We know Tomlin's also charged with child neglect. She's back in court. December 9th on all these new charges, plus those previous ones as well. We'll be here to follow that story. Live in Hampton, I'm Nico Clemens, 13 News Now.